In fact, this very conversation is multi uh, level absurd. So first of all, I should say that I just very recently uh, had a conversation with Jeff Bezos and uh, I would love to hear y your Beth Jezos opinions of Jeff Bezos. Speaking of intergalactic Jeff Bezos, uh, what do you think of that particular individual whom your name is inspired? Yeah, I mean, I think Jeff is really great. I mean, he's built one of the most epic companies of all time. He's leveraged the techno capital machine and techno capital acceleration to give us what we wanted, right? We want uh, quick delivery, very convenient at home, low prices, right? He understood how the machine worked and how to harness it, right? Like running the company, uh, not drink, trying to take profits too early, putting it back, put it, letting the system compound and keep improving. And, you know, arguably, I think Amazon's invested some of the most amount of capital and robotics out there. Um, and certainly with the birth of AWS kind of um, enabled the sort of tech boom we've seen today that has paid the salaries of, you know, I guess myself and all of our friends to some extent. And so I, th I think we can all be grateful to, you know, Jeff and he's one of the great entrepreneurs uh, out there, one of the best of all time. Unarguably. Uh, and of course, the the work at Blue Origin, similar to the work at SpaceX, is trying to make humans a multi-planetary species, which uh, seems almost like a bigger thing than the capitalist machine. Or it's a capitalist machine at a different time scale, perhaps? Yeah. I, I think that, um, you know, companies, they tend to optimize, you know, quarter over quarter, maybe a few years out. But individuals that want to leave a legacy can think on a multi-decadal or multi-century timescale. And so the fact that some individuals are such good capital allocators that they unlock the ability to allocate capitals to goals that take us much further or are much further looking, you know, Elon's doing this with SpaceX, putting all this capital towards getting us to Mars. Um, uh, Jeff is trying to build Blue Origin, and I think he wants to build O'Neill cylinders and get industry off planet, uh, which I think is brilliant. Um, I think, you know, just overall, I'm I'm for billionaires. I know this is a controversial statement sometimes, but I think that uh, in a sense, it's kind of a, a proof of stake voting, right? Like if, if you've acquired, if you've allocated capital efficiently, you get, you unlock more capital to allocate just because clearly you know how to allocate capital mo more efficiently, which is in contrast to politicians that get elected because they speak the best on TV, right? Not because they have a proven track record of allocating taxpayer capital most efficiently. And so that's why I'm for uh, capitalism uh, over, say, giving all our money to the government and letting them figure out how to allocate it. So, 